Hi, welcome to Patriot 2.0. In this episode, we're talking about BIOS and the boot menu. This is the BIOS boot menu. From here, I can tell my computer to boot from a thumb drive, a CD drive, I can tell it to boot from the hard drive, anywhere I have a device that has an operating system installed. Right as you start up your computer on the very bottom of the screen, there will be little messages that say things like F2 or F12 or delete. You press these buttons before Windows boots. If you miss it, press Control Alt Delete to restart BIOS. Just try that now. Fire up your computer, press Control Alt Delete before the Windows logo pops up, and you'll notice that you can make the computer loop and continue to restart. So we can go into the boot menu and tell BIOS exactly where you want to boot from. From the boot menu, I can tell BIOS to boot from my CD drive or my hard drive or a thumb drive or multiple different hard drives. Now, if I go into the, ad the advanced BIOS configuration settings, I can actually set my BIOS set my computer to boot from a specific device from a specific order. So that means I can say, hey, if I have a live CD, a Windows live CD or a Linux live CD, if I have a live CD in, if I have a bootable disk in my CD drive, boot that disk first. You can tell BIOS, always check to see if there is a live disk bootable in my computer before I boot from the hard drive. Now, this is a very great option to, to set when you're trying to learn Linux. Set your BIOS boot order to always boot from your CD-ROM or DVD-ROM. All right, so as you'll see here, you'll, the BIOS can be a bit confusing. You'll notice on the bottom of the screen, there's some some codes to tell you what to do. F1 is help. There's a left, there's a right, there's an F6. And on the right side of the of the BIOS screen, it gives me a little bit of a clue on how to maneuver these different choices. So it says press F6 and F5 to change the order. So now here you can see that I am moving my boot priority to different places. All right, so this is important to know. You have to know this stuff. Uh, there's a lot of different configurations inside your BIOS. You can get fancy motherboards that have far more configuration options. Uh, on a basic level, really just knowing your boot order will do the job for Linux. And that's all you're going to need to know about BIOS for right now. Now, personally, I prefer to simply pull up the boot menu rather than pull up the entire BIOS configuration. And if I need to boot from a drive, I will just simply go straight into my BIOS boot menu and boot when I need to. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you on the next episode.